Welcome to the 2017 NCHA Lucas Oil Super Stakes. I'm here with Holly Francois, the winner of the limited non-pro four-year-old final. She rode Smart Dual Cat and scored a 217 and a half. Congratulations to you, Holly. Thank you. Thank you. How does it feel when you to be described as a NCHA major champion? That's usually my husband's calling, <laughs> not mine. Uh, it feels amazing. I'm just so thankful to be here tonight and amongst the people that I was showing with tonight and to make the non-pro finals. Um, Richard and Beth Carney gave us opportunity to buy this horse. It was actually a horse we had in training for them as a three-year-old and shown at the Futurity and um, we've just loved him and they decided to make a change and we uh, bought him right before the show. So this has been a sweet victory. <laughs> wow, you yeah. really haven't had too much time to gel but obviously you did. No, we did. He's um, you know, I think a little less pressure in the non-pro, and I'm surely not asking him like, and he just, to me, he's just in, on autopilot out there, just takes care of me, and I never feel like he's not totally hooked to that cow or in the right spot. As long as I'm doing my job, he's there 100%. Now, you were third last out, and it was pretty wide open because at that point, I think the top score was like a 215. Yeah. So what was your game plan coming into it? Tonight, I just I just wanted to go in and make my cuts clean and, and really try to prepare for tomorrow night. I didn't want to have a big wreck or put him in a really bad position. You know, I just wanted to try to stay clean. And then as the run was building, my help, Bo and Lee, just were like, come on on that last cow, drive him up there. And I did, and now I really felt tonight what they've been telling me, like get him way up, and, you know, push cow way up and kick him across there. And he's felt amazing. <laughs> Is it satisfying when you get given those instructions and you actually make it happen? Yes, because that doesn't happen very often. <laughs> they, uh, they were fussing at me last night because I wasn't using my feet enough. And so it was, yeah, it was awesome. It was an amazing feeling. Yeah. Now, and you did have um, a futurity champion you're up against, um, Jody McLaughlin. McLaughlin had her um, horse straight after yours. So um, did that make you nervous after you'd finished your run? No, I was so thankful for, I didn't, where I ended up at that point, I was just tickled when I saw my score and, and, and glad that I presented him well and I think my husband was proud of me and that means a lot. So I was, no, I was just, just absolutely thrilled and I couldn't do it without my daughter's support. I knew her eyes were beaming when I came out and yeah, it was you, awesome. You got the biggest whoops of the night. Oh, I did? Oh, good. I didn't hear anything. <laughs> I no. couldn't hear anything. When your husband is a professional uh, trainer, Lee Francois, um, what kind of advice do you take from him when you go out and compete? Well, I haven't been showing much. Um, I have a three-year-old and I have a seven-year-old that I've been showing on the weekend, so I get to show a little bit, but our main focus is our business and the open horses and customer horses, so I'm not, I've kind of been not in tune with his his coaching about showing in a while just because I haven't had an aged fin horse and uh, but it's it's been good I don't watch cows with him I get my horse ready and I think that that helps because um, I need to be riding to be prepared and be warmed up too and I guess I'm so used to getting horses ready that's just my comfort zone okay. so um, I've got great help though between Bo and Lee and they take really good care sometimes Lee gets really quiet because I think he's completely freaked out at the choices I'm making maybe <laughs> But Bo keeps talking to me and Clay out front and Jamie. I have awesome help. So Okay, and finally, you've got tomorrow night, and what are your plans for the horses? Yes, um, tomorrow night I'm first out in the non-pro, so I'm just going to try to have another clean run and uh, head to the BI after this. So Best of luck with that. It's Thank time for your presentation. Thank you, Holly. Thank you so much. You're